This looks good. Sophie, do you have that? 7200. Yep. Hey Ben, we're pretty much ready for you down here. Oh. Nice! Ah! Ben, you see that patch of light? It's gonna go away. That's where I want your turn. We saved. There's like a nice panel we might shoot next time. It's pretty cloudy, so I think we should just send him. Okay, we're ready. <laughs> oh my gosh, we lean on so many people. Yeah. I think we lean on each other a lot um, for just the everyday stuff, you know, like talking things out. But there's a huge community of really helpful mentors and peers that we've called multiple times before every shoot we go on, like just double checking, like gear and ideas and bouncing ideas off each other and, and it. like really important because yeah just makes you mess up less <laughs> what are you doing so we are well right now I'm shooting some foggy trees very moody. Um, we're waiting for Kate and V to get up to the top of this little pillow. Um, we're dealing with an interesting set of very- It used to be a lot more kind of gatekeepy and a lot more like, I'm not gonna tell you what lens I used for that shot or I'm not gonna tell you how to edit. We're not gonna share information. And then in the time that we kind of have grown our careers, we've been really lucky to find a bunch of really quality amazing mentors and they've taught us so much and helped us and hyped us up there's a wealth of information sharing going on right now like in our field um as long as you have community and i feel like we are lucky enough to have it um so we've been able to tap into that and it's been the most important thing yeah i would say to our growth yes. as I filmers and photographers <laughs> <laughs> WWJCD. Yeah, Nexus was a ski movie project that I helped with. Um, it took probably two years in total to bring it to life. Um, we had an all-female production staff, essentially, so um, female director, three female producers, and a um, female DP. Probably, yeah, hovering around the zero mark, but, and dropping, I'd say. And then, same thing in the field, like, it's so huge to be on a team with people that believe in you and know that you have what it takes to learn how to do the thing. They might agree with you when you're like, I don't know if I can do it. They're like, yeah, but you can figure it out. <laughs> and that is like, you can't put a value on that. I had a really similar path where those people who are down to just kind of pick you up for a moment like along the way and just show you something or believe in you is what gets you to the next phase. And if you don't have that, I don't really know how people do it. It's those people who are willing who just take time to kind of be like, you don't know yet, but I can help. And then that is everything, it's everything. Sure. Yeah, but I don't think either one of us have had like a mentor, like a mentor who right. has, has been there forever. It's always just like that person who comes into your life for maybe a year, maybe less, maybe more, and then they kind of step out. Then it's like, and then the relationship changes, you know? Um, but it's so important. Yeah, I think our friendship has been a huge asset to both of our careers in that we pull each other along on whatever we're working on. And it's not just we can work together, it's just like, I'm having a really hard day, like <laughs> calling each other in the middle of shoots that aren't going well and being able to like talk each other through it.
we're like a little bit further along in our careers and there have been some people that have reached out. Yeah, they just wanna talk about it. Right. They're like, I'm so interested in this, like how do you do it? Yeah. And yeah, and I is try it to- fun? Is it worth it? Should I try? Yeah, I try to answer everyone. Do what I can to be like, there's a million ways to do it and as long as you don't quit, you'll probably be successful. <laughs>